What's up? It's Colin. Today we're working in the sales department once again, and today we're going to be bringing in you an informational video all about the differences between ceramic heat emitters and the all new infrared heat projector. All right, so let's get into it. So one of the primary differences um, regarding these two different types of products. So first off, your ceramic heat emitter. This product has been on the market for a very long time. Um, these guys work primarily, uh, first thing you'll take a look, so on this guy, basically you have this filament that is encased in a ceramic material. The electricity flows through the filament and that's basically what creates the heat. So the, the main difference with this product is uh, ceramic heat emitters print produce infrared C. So what is infrared C? So basically that means that this product heats up the air itself. So these are generally suited for terrarium applications where you're going to heat up the air and they tend to do so in this outward radiant direction. Now this has been the status quo for a very long time, but there has been a new, uh, I would say an improvement to this type of technology in the market within the past couple years. So this is the inf or the deep heat projector, or they'll also be called the infrared heat projector. So if you look on the profile, it's a little bit different. So these guys have a filament as well. I think it's a carbon fiber or a tungsten filament that's encased in glass. But if you look at this product, it, it has actually a reflector built in. So this product actually produces uh, infrared A and infrared B. So what does that mean? So basically these guys um, produce that infrared A and B, which is a much more directional shortwave radiation that is actually bioavailable to your reptile. So that basically means that the radiation or the infrared produced from this device actually penetrates the, your animal's skin and into its muscle, muscle tissues. So this actually much more efficiently uh, heats your animal compared to the ceramic heat emitter, which is basically just heating the air. These guys as well, a couple of distinguishing features. So these guys are actually rated for use with enclosed lamp systems, which can be an advantage. So if you have a deep dome light fixture or a, in the smaller ones, a mini deep dome fixture, um, those will all seat these devices. You could also safely use this in a combo dome fixture. Comparatively to the ceramic heat emitter, these guys are only rated for use in wire light fixtures. So again, you're gonna to have to have a secondary fixture. Um, and these guys are definitely not designed to be contained. So you definitely want that air ventilation around these guys. If you're to use this in a deep dome uh, or like an eight and a half inch clamp lamp, that's gonna be not very good because it's gonna, that fixture itself is gonna absorb all that heat. It's gonna be not ideal. Another distinguishing factor between these two products. So uh, for some home applications, this may matter, but um, the DP projector uses about 50% of the electricity that the ceramic heat emitter does. So for folks that are very energy conscious, that can be a tremendous power savings, especially if you have a lot of reptiles at home or you just wanna minimize the amount of power you're using. If you have any questions about these products, be sure to ask an associate and we can guide you on your way.